There we go. Medusa's drop speed potions, don't need to check that. Uh, I think this is attack potion. Uh, um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Where is it? Where is it? Ah, there we go. Attack potion. Uh, yeah. Th this drop attack potion. Beholders drop uh, defense. Yin's drop speed potions like you saw there. Uh, Leviathan's drop uh, defense potions. Uh, the end gods, they drop defense potions. I think uh, the flying brains. Flying pro brains drop attack potions like I thought. Ghost gods, I think it's speed potion. Might be wrong there. No, it's a speed, speed potion. Oh god damn it, I'm good. The slime gods drop defense potions, and I think uh, these drop attack potion. I was correct! Damn, I'm good. I knew all of them. I knew all of them what they drop. <laughs> Even though I was doubting myself a little bit. So, speed potions are actually surprisingly rare. A lot. I have grinded so many, uh, so many of these. So yeah. So Ghost uh, Yin and Medusa for speed potions. Uh, the ends, ends, slimes, beholders, and leviathans for defense, and flying brains and white demons for, and uh, sprite gods for attack. That's about it. This for attack. This for speed potion, and uh, rest of them for defense. Oh, basically, you just uh, have to grind. You have to grind and st try to stay alive. It's not actually hard to survive once you are level 20 and you go to party. Pause. I'd, you just have to get better. That's all. Just learn how the enemies work. Like, uh, for example, let's see what do I get here. The end gods, you keep moving up and down. Just move up and down or uh, away from them. Go away. Away ghosts, I'm trying to explain here. Anyways, uh, here. And just uh, they try to pre uh, uh, predict your movements, so just keep uh, moving left and right, left and right, left and right. Or let's go to here. Oh, so I go below them, it's easier to dodge them from below. Get here. And you go away. Oh, there we go. So you just keep moving left and right, and they will never really hit you. See, they will keep on uh, missing you, unless uh, you are standing still. See, they keep missing you. I can just stand there all day, and then I can just kill it. And uh, let's see, this one, it's really easy to, to dodge. These uh, ghosts are one of the easier to kill. You just have to stand there and dodge or their, bol their bolts, really easy to dodge, they're so slow. Okay, there we go. There's another ghost. Let's see. Uh, what do we have next? What do we have next? You just have to pay attention where you have been before. And here we go. Flying brains, they're really easy. Just keep on. Uh, Moving slightly, and they will constantly m miss you. Just keep on moving slightly, and they will never hit, never hit you. They try to shoot towards you, but it doesn't even matter because their damage is so weak that you don't even have to dodge them most of the time if you have decent defense. They shoot fast, but it's really weak. The flying brains, one of the weaker weaker gods. And here we have Medusas, one of my favorites, because you can just run around them. You can just run around them, and they will keep on missing you. As you can see, 
Really easy to dodge. And next one we have the white demons. These are actually really really hard for melee classes. Uh, you can outrun them. You can outrun them if you have enough defense or enough speed. You can outrun the bolts. The bolts can never hit you. But other than that, these are actually hard to dodge, and they do pierce your armor. So that's a little bit annoying. I think they do actually predict your movement too a little bit. Not really that much. Anyways, uh, you can outrange them with uh, characters like this. Um, do not, uh, do not uh, solo abus if you don't know what you're doing. But uh, basically, just take it easy. You have to have max defense. That's absolutely, that's absolutely max. Uh, one thing you have to have, you have to have max defense if you want to go solo abus. And you should have max uh, speed. You should have max attack, and you should have max dexterity. And uh, the higher the vitality is, the better, basically. And let's see, let's see. What do we have next? Uh, those we have already told. Uh, let's see if, if I can find a beholder. Nope, I have explained those. Mm, let's see, let's see. No oh, ghosts. Go away, ghost. I want beholders. Ah, there is the slime gods. Slime gods are actually one of the hardest gods because, well, they shoot so fast, they're hard to dodge, and so on. Where is the slime? I think it died. Um, and they do slow you, so be careful about that slow. I'd say just move away from the slimes and keep kiting them. That's the best way to kill them. But their slime gods are really annoying, but they do drop defense potions, and there is one defense potion, by the way. Um, this end. I want one beholder. Beholder, give me beholder. He doesn't want to give me a beholder. Ah, there we go. Basically, beholders have that very slow attack that they have there. It's really easy to dodge their attacks. So there's are actually one of the easier ones to dodge. And the blind isn't that dangerous really. You can see usually what's happening. And the blind is actually predicting your movements. So if you keep moving like left and right, left and right, left and right, uh, the blind will keep miss you. Like you can see it's uh, missing it quite uh, heavily. But it will keep uh, predicting your movement. So if you move to right, it will try to shoot where you are going, like you see there. But yeah, these are really easy. Uh, just try to find good groups to level up with and try to stay safe. Oh yeah, then there is the uh, there is the sprite gods. Kinda annoying. Uh, sprite gods, you need max defense to kill them efficiently. But if you get the, come on, get here, end. Get here, end. Uh, the sprites, if you have enough defense, you can just go a little bit to uh, go a little bit uh, to one side of them, and then you can uh, get too close enough to them, and once you are close enough, you can outrun their attacks, like you can see here. I'm uh, running faster than their attacks, they try to shoot it towards me, basically. So they are not that hard if you have maxed speed, but you need high speed to be able to dodge them properly. And then there is the Leviathans. They shoot randomly and they have two attacks. They shoot randomly and one of the attacks shoot towards you. Uh, not really that dangerous, honestly. Come on, right here. Uh, basically you just have to keep be constantly moving and try to find the spots where they are not attacking. And those spots are random. So... It's actually quite easy to dodge the Leviathans, but they do lo shoot a lot, which is kind of hard. And when you are killing the Leviathans, always aim, aim in front of them. Don't aim towards them, but aim, aim uh, uh, ahead where they are moving and you will hit them. Because they will constantly keep on moving. I think that's, that's about it. I think I covered all of the gods there. Hope that helped you guys.
that's uh, all the tips I can give uh, for or knowing how the enemies move. I'm thinking I'm missing someone, but I don't think so. But basically just get used to the gods and you can easily uh, grind god bands without any kind of defense too. Only the only issue, if you have no defenses really with the slime gods, they will keep on hitting you when you try to kill them. So the best way to kill slime gods is just get good stats and then just kill them. Because they aren't really that strong but they shoot a lot. Oh yeah, Jins! <laughs> well, I kind of forgot, but Jins are just easy. When they come towards you, wait for them to come towards you and start shooting from nearby, then just back off. I knew that I was forgetting someone. But Jins are uh, super easy. Oh, I cannot fit that one soon in my inventory. And when you're playing with Necromancer and you're taking some damage, uh, try to pull a groups towards you and then aim at the edge of the screen and you should be hitting them with the spell if you're low on the health. You can actually go towards the enemies or go towards them with pretty low health and still be fine with Necromancer. Oh, come on, I want the potion. Damn it. There we go. I could go through the lesser gods too, but they are pretty easy. I don't uh, even think I don't think the lesser gods as a threat, right? Especially since they reduce the amounts of players. Jeez, oh, I need to go trade now. <laughs> I'm ha having too many potions. <laughs> Ah, no, sorry, my rogue needs all the speed he can get right now. Remember that I am remaking my my rogue. So it's on the original tip. Big enough to man like Life Link. It's on a near death EP. Besides, uh, I would only sell up for three, three speed, where one defense. to do two, two trades here. <laughs> <laughs> 